The project is located in Santa Maria de Mancu, commissioned by a couple who acquired a plot of land with a large garden and a colonial-style house from the 1980s that did not take advantage of its surroundings. The client's intention was to develop a new house above the existing one, as the original one did not take advantage of the panoramic views of the city and closed off interesting points of its landscape environment, such as the large surrounding garden, the Andes mountain range to the east, and the summit of Cerro Mancu to the north. This same closing condition was detrimental to the interior light of the rooms, which were shady, cold, and with moisture already ingrained in the walls. This, combined with the highly vegetated location, poorly oriented windows, and the shade cast by the mountain, aggravated this condition, so the new house had to solve these problems and be efficient in terms of energy consumption. To achieve energy efficiency, the form factor and space of the rooms had to be tailored to capture natural light and subtly appropriate the views of the city to avoid disrupting the environment. Overhangs facing south were arranged to open to the views with perforations in the roof to allow the passage of northern light and the view of Cerro Mancu. The interior space was designed to generate a connection between the floors and thus allow radiation to enter in winter through the second floor to the first level. Where the mass of the first floor walls, insulated from the outside, was used to accumulate solar gains and generate a balance of temperatures inside following the principles of passive solar design. This same continuous insulation avoids thermal bridges in the coldest areas and eliminates the condensation that generated great humidity inside the previous house. The intelligent and efficient lighting systems proposed in the house were connected to a photovoltaic system located in a strategic area of the north roof, which receives the highest annual radiation, to provide continuous electricity without depending on fossil energy generators. Here's a look at the plan. Although the landscaping was existing and the owners asked to preserve it, it was complemented and restored mainly with naturalized and endemic species of the region, which have low water consumption to optimize this resource. Thank for watching and subscribing to our channel. HDI Home Design Ideas we'd appreciate it.